So, I have something a little different. We're going to have you play this game. Oh, boy. Is this Flappy Birds? It is. I thought this was a... Illegal now. I gotta tell you something, I'm really bad at this kind of stuff. I'm a disaster at this. <laughs> My grandchildren refuse to play with me. It's a very simple game. Good, that fits me. The keypad right in front of you? Yep, you just tap it. Yep. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't take long. Not so high, Richard. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not staying here all day doing this. Oh, uh, ten more times, though. Ten more times? You're out of your mind. Whoops. <laughs> what did you think was gonna happen? This is torture, you know. <laughs> what is this crazy game called? Suicide? Okay, time to really focus. Come on now. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> It's the most difficult game in the world! Ah. I... Oh. Come on! I kicked up I didn't kill you! Yeah. Chicken sh Rat's ass, I am. Come on, Don. Come on, Don. Come on, Don. It's bullshit. Oh. You got one. You got one. I did. Oh. Okay, I got one. Oh, gee. I got a point. Yes. You got one. Don't try to make me feel good. Whoops, 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 whoops. Oh, oh so close. Ah, I made it almost to the second pipe. Boom, boom, boom. How long will you continue torturing me and embarrassing me? So people can go, God, those old people, they're terrible. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Yes, gentlemen, <laughs> I'm not a game player. I hate this, and I hate you guys. <laughs> All right, that's it, done. One more time. No. One more. No, you can't get me to keep doing this, forget it. I'm trying so hard to do something so simple and it's so difficult. You, know, you wanna shoot that little bird, break that big screen up, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so that game is called Flappy Bird. Flappy Bird, huh? what a clever title. Would you say that you like this game? <laughs> you know what, I, I actually did. It's just addictive. Kind of more of a jungle jewels kind of gal. No. It's boring. All it did was frustrate me. I'm not a game person. Theater is the, is the most exciting game there is. What is the one word you'd use to describe how the game makes you feel? Oh, frustrated. Anxious. Uncoordinated. <laughs> Four pounds of in a three pound bag, that's how I describe it. Well, recently this game became the number one free downloaded game on phones. Wow. Big deal, it's free. People complain about this game, even though they download it. They say it's horrible, but they can't stop. Why are they still playing if they're that frustrated? Addiction? Because they don't hate the game, they hate the fact that they haven't gotten it yet. I love thoroughbred horse racing, but it's very frustrating because I keep playing and I keep losing, so maybe, maybe there's a comparison there. In the back of your mind, you always think you're gonna beat it. 
And that, that's the appeal, you know, you go, oh, I can do better than one, oh, I can do better than two. They're so into games with their little IHOP things and whatever it is. Any game, they'll they'll play it. How much money do you think the creator of the game makes off of the game? 5,000. I well, they can make a thousand bucks a day. They yeah. read about this $50,000 a day he was making. It was reported that at its peak, he was making $50,000 a day. <laughs> Time to get back to HTML. Wow, I gotta come up with a game like that. So then that proves how, how far we're falling. How is that possible? Me and other people who worked so hard for so many years to make small amounts of money, and these people come up with these silly games and all of a sudden they get money all over the place. I think it's disgusting. He wasn't making as much as the guys who created Google. So what's he? he? Ain't nothing. It's pretty impressive, though. The person who created this game is from Vietnam, and he's an independent game developer. So his money's all his. But he had to deal with all of this hate because people were downloading it, but they were also saying it's the worst game ever. They were being racist against him, and even death threats came because of this game. <laughs> You're kidding! He's getting death threats for a game! People are crazy. That's ridiculous. Stop trying to understand people and you'll be happier. But that's their own fault! They're downloading it! It's not his fault! I wonder, uh, back in my day, if uh, there were any people who hated bingo or Monopoly and the creators of those games. We didn't have the social media to hear uh, their, their expression. I think people feel that they're free if they hide behind a screen. Ask yourself, you know, is, is that who I am and who I want to be? So if you were him and made this game and all of this happened, what do you think you would do? I would laugh all the way to the bank. Stay hidden and change my name. I'd love to deal with that problem, wouldn't you? Good gravy, 50,000 a day on a game? I don't know. I kind of come from the peace and love generation. I would be so floored especially with the hate. His decision, despite all the money, was to stop letting people download the game. I admire him for that. I would have thought uh, he would have done it and kept it going for the money. The nutty people who are harassing him won, and that it's not right. He'd had enough. He can walk away from things too, you know. Don't blame him. A guy who really tried to be pure about it, to have a lot of integrity around it, to get slammed, I think I would have crashed and burned too. So what would you want to say to the creator if he was watching this? I think the hell with them all. Just make your games and enjoy it. I'm really sorry that the world sucks right now because I thought we would have cleaned it up by now. You have a real talent. I love Snappy Fish. I really wish you'd put that back on. I love your independence. I love the fact that you just went F you all, I'm taking my game down, you people. But you gotta remember, people are people. All that hatred wasn't really directed at you. So, do you wanna play the game more? No. Absolutely not. No, thank you. Got Candy Crush Saga? I kicked butt on Candy Crush Saga. Thank you for watching this frustrating, but really fun episode of Elders React. Let us know in the comments what game we should play next. Have a good day. Don't ever suggest to me a game like Flappy Bird ever again.